Alright, YouTube, what's up? It's, uh, Chris here. I to tripods. Um, watch this video in high quality, guys. Right down here. Give that a click before you move on. Alright. Uh, now, hopefully, that you guys are watching this in high quality. Uh, I got a review for you guys to do. On the CDO, um, in okay slider, uh, for the iPod Touch first generation. Um, so it's gonna allow me to take my second generation and move it off to the side. Oops. Oh, with it. Um, throw that on the tape. Alright, so. This case was donated to me by CDO, um, very graciously, so I can do the review on it for them. Um, which I've really been long awaiting to, uh, get this case, because I've heard great things about it. So let's open it up, guys. If you didn't see the unboxing video, go check that out. So put the plastic off to the side. Comes like this. You take it apart like that. Um, comes with this, just like everything else does. This cardboard, plastic. Um, it just says stuff about CDO. It says CDO is the leading developer of smartphone and PDA accessories with a passion for innovation. We're a visionary company committer to committer to satisfying our com customers. Excuse me. Um, and you can go visit them at CDO online <coughs> or CDO.com. Just how it's spelled right there. I will try to get their link in the video description. Um, so yeah guys, great case right here. Um, it is a two-piece slider case, so if you do have an invisible shield or something on your iPod, it will be complicated to get on, but thankfully I don't. Alright, so here, let's just take a look at the case first. Um, let's take a look at the top part. It is a, a rubber case almost, it is a hard plastic, but it has a rubbered finish very nice finish guys it is very smooth to the touch um hasn't scratched it you can just like run your nails across or something like that if you have nails um i don't really and then you can just like really literally just wipe it away and it'll go like into it just wipe it through use and there they just totally disappear um so that's just little surface scratches it'll protect it from that um the case itself um very smooth texture i love that uh cut out for the home, uh, excuse me, cut up for the power button, uh, sleep uh, button as well. Uh, then on the inside, it has a felted back, a uh, felt velvety textured back. Um, very nice. Can you guys see that? Hopefully you can. You can see that. Very nice texture to protect the back of your iPod Touch. Um, and then it has, if you guys, I don't know if you can really see that, but grooves going down the sides. Um, let's see. Uh, on the inside, I don't know if you can see it, but over here, there are grooves going down there to guide your iPod in there. You can kind of see them right there, but there are grooves to guide your iPod when it's sliding in. Alright, let's take a look at the bottom piece. The bottom piece also has the felt velvety textured uh, piece right here to protect the bottom of your iPod. It has the clip and the two side, sorry, two side clips that clip into each side of the case. Um, it does have a fully open dock, so you can charge, sync, and listen to your music with the case on. Great feature. Now let's put it on the case, on the iPod. You just take it like so. It takes a little effort. Slide it in. Once it reaches the top, give it another little push until you can feel the power button right there. Um, then you take your bottom piece. You can turn this upside down. And this is the hard part that I find with this case. Um, you have to get this perfectly lined up. Hopefully I'll get it good right here. You, there is a, um, like I said, those, <clears throat> excuse me, that niche right there. You see that thing standing up right there out of it? You have to line that up right under that little hole right there. So you got to line it up. Well, you got to line up both sides at the same time while that clip is going underneath that hole. Um, it is a good design. It's just hard to work with. Um, it's good. It's a good design because um, it does offer you great protection, and you know that your case isn't going to come off unless you take it off purposely. So just give me a minute, and then it snaps in place like that. If you heard that, if not, it snaps in place. It's not going to go anywhere. Um, you have the little button right there to take it off. You just push that down and pull. Um, but here it is, guys. It's on your iPod Touch. It covers the, all the. Um, I was going to say chrome bezel, but this is the first gen, so it doesn't have a chrome bezel. But it does cover all the corners. Um, it does give it an extra lift. So, facing it straight down, no fears doing that. It's not going to uh, 
get to your screen or anything like that. Um, it is very smooth around here as well, so you don't need to worry about that either. There's the open dock I was talking about. Um, and there's the back as a whole. The whole thing is very smooth, great rubberized texture. Um, it is a hard case. Um, it's not going to bend. Um, just another low flaw I found is that actually you, if you push in on this side right here, you can actually hear it uh, almost moving a little bit towards the iPod. Um, but hopefully that's just me and hopefully that's just with this case. Um, so, nothing major, guys. This is a great case. Um, I, I would trust this case if I were to drop my iPod. It is very hard. It's going to stop it from getting scratched or getting hurt. Um, very nice case. Not afraid to drop it on the screen. Um, that's basically it, guys, for the CDO Inno case for the iPod Touch first generation. Go check them out. Uh, their link will be in the video description. I will try my hardest to get that in there. Um, once again, there's the power button right there. Give it a click. It goes on. Uh, bottom. Pull the open dock. Just take a look at the sides. Very nice finish. Very nice finish. I love this rubber texture feeling. Um, very nice. Take one last look at the case, guys. Look at that. This is a very nice case. Um... So, go check them out, guys. CDOonline.com. You guys can read that. And also, um, me and a couple other of my friends over here on YouTube uh, started a uh, blogging site almost. Um, kind of like a Mac Rumors or Apple Insider kind of site. Um, we have updates every day on that site. Um, a bunch of updates every day. So far, we've added at least four today. Um, go check it out. The link will be in the video description. It is appleupdaters.webs.com. Um, hopefully, we hope to get that pretty big so we can eventually buy our own domain name. So go check us out, guys. Support us on that site. Um, check back every day for information uh, and Dale's daily updates on uh, everything Apple. Uh, jailbreak updates, um, app reviews, uh, special uh, recommended products. I might throw this one up there because um, I do like it a lot. And... Um, just a bunch of good stuff. Um, so go check it out, guys. AppleUpdaters.webs.com and CDOonline.com. Um, very nice case for the Apple Touch first generation. I'll see you guys in my next review. Take care. Be safe. Comment, favorite, rate, subscribe, guys. Peace out. Take care.